Hello everyone. Today we are going to see about the fundamental structure of an atom. But before that, what is atom? According to the definition of Andalton, the smallest and indivisible part of any matter is called as atom. That we very well know. But this is just a definition. Today we are going to see it by diagrammatical representation. Let us see. Now, in case of atom, according to Dalton, it is the smallest and indivisible. But it is not indivisible. It is divisible. How? Let us see. This is atom. In case of this atom, this atom is going to divide into two parts. Which are they? One is the nucleus and another one is the extra nuclear region. But what is it exactly? In case of atom, as we know, there are two parts in which nucleus is the central part. This nucleus surrounded by an extra nuclear region. So this is the these are the fundamental parts of an atom but how exactly they are why we have written this plus at the center of an atom that is the nucleus as we are saying the center part is nothing but a nucleus but we are putting a symbol plus why is it so because atom is going to divide into two parts that is nucleus and extra nuclear region but rather than these two parts again going to subdivide into some another parts let us see what it is now this nucleus has again some sub particles which are they protons and neutrons protons are always going to symbolize by p as well as the neutrons are going to symbolize by n. So, these protons and neutrons collectively form in this nucleus in which this proton carries positive charge and neutron carries no charge. So, as we have discussed earlier, nucleus is made up of protons and neutrons in which proton is carrying a positive charge and neutron having no any charge. That means no any charge plus positive charge. Obviously, the sum gives the positive charge. That is why we are putting this plus symbol at the representation of nucleus. That is why nucleus is always a positively charged. Now, what is extra nuclear region? We can see that. This is the extra nuclear region around the nucleus. This extra nuclear region contains some negatively charged particles. Which are those negatively charged particles? They are nothing but electrons, which are going to denote by a symbol small e. Now, this electrons are having negative charge, those are present in extra nuclear region. And the nucleus is having positively charged that means there is a oppositely charged particles which are present inside the atom that is why this negative and positive oppositely charges attract to each other and they are forming this atom now these electrons which are negatively charged are continuously revolving around this nucleus just because of force of attraction between this positively charged particle that is nucleus and negatively charged particles according to this fundamental part we are having a perfect structure of an atom just see this is the nucleus and this is nothing but a extra nuclear region this extra nuclear region is containing some negatively charged particles that is electrons and this positively charged particle that means a proton which is present inside the nucleus along with a neutron 
So this is what the fundamental structure of an atom. Thank you.